Hey guys, it's Laurie. Um, unfortunately, it started to rain as I started doing this, so I hope that um, you're going to be able to hear me pretty well. Um, so sorry if the volume on this ends up being really low. Uh, so I'm doing a uh, 25 questions tag, and um, I was kind of inspired to do this. One of my subscribers, Sentimental Butterfly, uh, had seen a picture of my dog in one of my candle collection videos and she asked me to do a video on her and so um, I kind of wanted to do one anyway because I actually don't have any pictures of me and Jenna so this is kind of a good opportunity to do this and I found this tag that uh, the nose no 76 had posted where the first question is do you have any pets so this is a good opportunity to kind of uh, take care of a few videos that I need to do so Okay, so here is my pet. Uh, like I said, her name is Jenna, and she um, she's the only one that I have. I actually got her when uh, my mom was doing uh, fostering for a rescue group, and actually, well, she still does, but uh, so Jenna was one of the fosters that she got, and I wasn't really in a position where I wanted a dog like I knew at some point I would end up wanting one but it wasn't really then and um but I was over at, at my parents house and she um she was kind of following me around like she just decided that I was gonna you know be her owner and be responsible for her. and she kind of grew on me so I decided to uh to keep her and she really is a sweetie she uh, I think she's at least partly Maltese. I don't know. There's probably something else in there, but I'm not sure what it is. And I think she's about 13, so she's pretty old. She has lost pretty much all of her teeth, so her tongue hangs out of her mouth. It's actually not doing too bad today. Sometimes it's like like way down here. <laughs> um, so yeah, it's, it's kind of gross, but it's kind of cute too. And you know... It's like kind of that situation where it's a face only a mother could love, really. <laughs> but anyway, so yeah, this is this is Jenna. Hi. Okay. Let's see. Sit tight, Jenna. All right, so the next question is name th three things that are physically close to you. All right, so the first one is a spoon. It's kind of random stuff. Um, I was using this to eat grapefruit this morning, so that's why this is right here, sitting at the coffee table. The second one is uh, the second Pop-Tart in this pack of, what is this? This is a new, almost a new scent. It's a new flavor called like frosted hot chocolate or something like that. I don't know, it was pretty good, so. And the third thing is a roll of toilet paper. Yeah, so this, um, my downstairs bathroom didn't have any toilet paper. So I went upstairs and got some, so for whatever reason it was up there. And when I came down, I don't know, I got distracted or something and ended up sticking this on the coffee table instead of the bathroom. I don't know, go figure. So. All right, what's the weather like right now? It sucks. It is rainy, it's hot, muggy. Um, yeah, I hate it. I like cold weather. I'm very much a cold weather person, which this is definitely, Southern Louisiana is definitely the wrong place to be if you like uh, cold weather. But I don't know, maybe one day I'll get out. Um, do you drive? If so, have you crashed? I do drive. I have a um, 2012 black Toyota Corolla S that I just bought in July, and I love it. Um, I have been in a crash, though I've never been the cause of a crash, so I'm, I'm a pretty good driver. Okay, what time did you wake up this morning? I woke up probably like 6 30 7 o'clock somewhere around there i usually get up at 6 
to go to work Monday through Friday. And um, so, like, I'm now in the habit of just waking up around, you know, like, if I can sleep till 7, I'm sleeping late. That's pretty pathetic, but I just, I can't sleep very late. When was the last time you showered? This morning. What was the last movie you saw? Thursday night, my boyfriend and I watched Cabin in the Woods, which was very random. That was a crazy, silly movie. Um, I like scary movies, and I usually go into them with the knowledge that they're going to be pretty stupid, but I still like to watch them. Um, that one was, it was different. We enjoyed watching it, but yeah, it was not, it was not a favorite. Um, what does your last text message say? I don't remember. I think, and it's on my phone, and I'm not going to try to get to it because I'm actually using my phone as my camera. But I think it was from a coworker. One of my coworkers had sent me a text of another one of our coworkers um, in my lab coat, which I wear at work. It was after I had left. He decided to put on my lab coat and be, you know, I don't know, be silly. So. It was like an exchange between the two of us about that or something. I think I, my final message was something like, um, is this your attempt to overthrow me or something like that? I don't know. Anyway, um, what's your ringtone? I don't know what it's called. Again, it's on my phone. It's something, it's not like a standard telephone ring, but it's, something high pitched so that I can actually hear it when it rings. Have you ever been to a different country? Yes, I went to, um, I went to France and I went to the UK back in February. That was pretty awesome. That was my first time going overseas. I have been to like Mexico and Canada, uh, but I'd never been overseas until uh, this past year. So that was a really, really great experience. Although the plane ride really sucked. Do you like sushi? Yes, I love sushi. It's my favorite thing to eat. Um, I love the raw fish kind. That's my favorite because I just, I really like a fresh taste. I like it simple. I don't like all of the spicy mayo and sauces and all that kind of stuff. I really just like a good, a good rainbow roll is going to do it for me. Where do you buy your groceries? That really depends. Um, if it is a um, bad time of the day or like like on a Saturday or a Sunday, I will not go to Walmart. Um, I usually go to like Albertsons um, to get like standard things, although they're somewhat more expensive than Walmart. Um, if I just need something quick, I usually will go to Walmart as long as it's not like, you know, rush hour time. Um, but like I really, Walmart drives me nuts. I hate it. Um, if I need something special or want to get something different, I'll go to Fresh Market because uh, I love all of the, I don't know, I just love that experience in that store. Like for me, in some ways, it's worth it to pay a little bit more to not have to deal with the crazy rude people um, that are at Walmart. And like I really, I literally will have... Um, not panic attacks, but I am claustrophobic. So if there's like a lot of people kind of coming and going in the aisles, it not freaks me out, but it bothers me. Like I really, I don't like that. So I know that's kind of strange, but um, anyway, so yeah, I'll switch it up. And I try to go to other local grocery stores too. We, um, we do have a local farmer's market over here, which is really nice. Um, it's really cheap. It's like on the other side of town though, so it's a little bit hard for me to get to. And I'll, I'll go to Target, my sister works there, so I'll try to support that. But yeah, I, I kind of sp spread, um, spread my support around, so. Have you ever taken any medication to help you fall asleep faster? Um, I tried taking something, some Alteril or something that 
um, like I was having trouble with waking up in the middle of the night. Um, and so my doctor, doctor recommended Alteril, which I, it didn't really do anything for me. So I don't, but other than that, I mean, I have taken like Benadryl or something, um, to help me get to sleep, but nothing like, you know, I'm not hooked on anything or I don't have a prescription. How many siblings do you have? I have one, I have a younger sister. Um, her name is Stacy. Do you have a desktop computer or a laptop? I have um, kind of, I guess, a laptop upstairs that is a Dell and it's old and it sucks. Um, so I now use, I have a um, Chromebook, which I love. I love this thing. How old will you be turning on your next birthday? 31 um, next month, October 23rd, so. Do you wear contacts or glasses? Both, I wear contacts during the day and glasses in the evening when my contacts are starting to bother me and I just can't take them anymore. Do you color your hair? Yes, I do not um, really keep up with it as much as I should. In fact, it needs it now. I've got like lots of grays up here that you can't see, but um, they're definitely there and showing themselves. Tell me something you're planning to do today. Um, I don't know, I'm kind of thinking I've got a buy two, get two free coupon at Yankee. Um, I really don't want to spend the money, but it's the last day <laughs> and I kind of, um, I had watched Kiffy Cat's video of her, it was an exchange that she did at Yankee where she got like a blueberry scone tumbler and she, I know I'm kind of going off a can on a tangent here. She, what was it, was saying that she was afraid they were going to like the new smooth wax and that which I have noticed the smooth wax does not smell as strong as the marbled wax. So I was kind of thinking of going and getting that. And I was also thinking, I think some of the stores are supposed to have the new Christmas scents. Mine, last time I went in, I went to go get a present for a friend of mine the other day. And um, I asked about them and they were like, oh, our shipments are late. So um, we might not be getting them in for a while. Anyway, so I was gonna go check just to see if they had them in. Um, and uh, that's pretty much it. When was the last time you cried? Um, that was yesterday when, uh, so I had a dog, um, that we got in, it was my senior year, no, my junior year of high school. His name was Beignet, he was Maltese, um, and he was like awesome, best dog. And so, in fact, I'm probably going to start tearing up talking about this now. But um, we had to put him to sleep in June. Um, he had a collapsed trachea, so he was having trouble breathing. And he, he was like 13, so he, he lasted a long time. Um, but, um, so yeah, it's been, although he's like my parent, he was, you know, stayed at my parents' house. It still really felt like he was, you know, partially my dog. And, um, so yeah, it's been, it's been hard to deal with, uh, not having him around. And so yesterday I was trying to find, I knew that I had like some videos of him and yesterday I decided I wanted to try to find one. Um, so I went on my crappy Dell laptop upstairs cause I think that I thought that the videos were up there. And I couldn't find the video, but I found some other pictures of him that I had forgotten I had, and they were really cute. One of them was him in a little, um, like, Santa costume for Christmas. He had, like, a little Santa hat on. And so, anyway, yeah, I just kind of lost it and started crying. <laughs> so, sorry for the sob story, but, you know, that's what happens when you ask. What is your perfect pizza topping? I love pineapple and Canadian bacon. So like a Hawaiian style pizza. I love that.
Which do you prefer, hamburgers or cheeseburgers? I, I love cheese, but lately I've really preferred eating hamburgers over cheeseburgers, especially if um, the, the cheese, I, I really don't like that kind of fake processed um, cheese that come in the little single, you know, I don't know, like the Kraft Singles or whatever. I really don't like that kind of cheese. I like actually real stuff. Um, but in general, like I like the taste of a good hamburger that's cooked medium, which means a warm pink center. Um, but yeah, if I go to some place, like we have a local, there's a local uh, hamburger place here. At least I don't think it's anywhere else. It's called Ground Patty and they have the best hamburgers and they're like all throughout South Louisiana. Um, I will eat cheese on a hamburger that I get from there because they have like these interesting combinations of things like um, they have like a California burger which has Swiss cheese and sprouts and guacamole. Um, they have like a Cajun barbecue burger which is like a barbecue sauce and I'll get that with like pepper jack cheese. So if I get something from there, it's a cheeseburger but like at home, I usually just eat a hamburger. Have you ever had an all-nighter? Um, yeah, but it wasn't because I was studying. <laughs> it was a um, bachelorette party where we went to the French Quarter. So it was an all-nighter on Bourbon Street. What is your eye color? My eyes are kind of a mixture of a blue and a green. I don't think you can see them here, but... Yeah, it depends on the lighting. It also depends on the clothes I'm wearing. If I'm wearing like a green colored shirt, which I am today, although yeah, you can't see that. They look kind of more green, but um, yeah, so they, they kind of change color. Can you taste the difference between Pepsi and Coke? Yes, I definitely can. Uh, Pepsi is, to me, got a more sugary taste to it. Um, I don't know. It's, it's really strange. Like I can drink, I like both of them. In fact, I'll switch up depending on just kind of, you know, the mood that I'm in. Um, but yeah, I don't, I don't know how to describe that. Like I said, it, Pepsi to me tastes kind of more sugary. So anyway, Okay, well, I guess that's it. That went by kind of faster than I thought. But um, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. And, um, well, leave me any questions or comments. Thanks. Have a great day.